to the state capitol on Tuesday, a bipartisan group of state lawmakers unveiled a compromise bill that happened to prevent child sex abuse here in Montana and bring predators of that abuse to justice. However, some advocates uh, for the victims say the bill doesn't go far enough. The bill would allow prosecution at any time of those who sexually abuse children instead of the current limit, which says it must happen within 20 years of the crime. But the bill only slightly expands the current time limits when a victim of childhood sexual abuse can sue for damages. And a separate bill to remove those limits entirely ran into opposition and the compromise bill will take its place. Democrat State Representative Shane uh, Morgu of Missoula has sponsored that original bill, but said yesterday that he'll be carrying the compromise. Now, Republican State Representative Bill Mercer of Billings, who opposed removing the statute of limitations entirely on civil suits, said uh, um, very few states have taken that approach. He noted that the compromise bill also includes stricter reporting standards on child sex abuse to make it more likely perpetrators are prosecuted when the abuse happens. And yet the lead attorney for the victims abused by former Miles City athletic trainer told MTN Thursday that leaving civil lawsuit litigations in place protects only one in entity, and that is insurance companies who cover people for institutes that let the abuse happen. John Heenan says that uh, the so-called compromise is co um, compromising the rights of the victims and that limit should be removed. The bill still in draft form will be introduced sometime next month.